everybody. Today we're going to load the motorcycle, so stay tuned. So we have the loading system so that we can have the motorcycle in the back of the truck and also pull the camper. So we haven't had the motorcycle up in Maryland through the winter because there wasn't any good riding weather. But now that it's getting warmer, we've got that itch and we need that motorcycle. So Big Daddy's going to load it and we're going to take it back up to Maryland. So let's head outside. Uh, this is Big Daddy. We're going to be taking the bike back to Maryland this time. Uh, she was kind of upset because I've been leaving her, so she's got to go this time. And this happens to be a lift system that Bubbles bought me, I should say. Uh, it's called a toy track. It actually will pull the bike up in the truck. Uh, it takes some getting used to because actually the bike's only been in the back of the truck twice in almost a year. This is the second time. Uh, do not like trailing on a motorcycle, but this does make it to a one person operation to do so. So, uh, as you'll see in the video, I probably had to go around it a couple of times to try and remember exactly how to do this. It actually works off the battery in your truck. Once you get it in, you get it mounted. There's only two bolts that holds this whole system in the back of the truck. You put them on, bolt it down, and then you can... Uh, How you want to say it? You get them bolted down, then you can pretty much do how you want to do with it. I will say this: that the YouTube video makes it seem real easy to do this. Uh, in my case, I have to learn by experience, so it might be getting a little easier. But it does run off the battery in your truck. It's got two, you know, a negative and a positive. It comes all the way off the battery. I will note this to you if you have this system. Make sure you leave your truck running 
because it will kill your battery to load your motorcycle. I mean, it just use it's got a 2,500 pound winch. The motorcycle weighs 1,000 pounds, so we got more winch than what we need, and it's. I don't know how much more I can say about it. Once you get it set, it'll pull it right on in there. And then you can take a camper too. And then you can hook up behind your tag along or whatever you want to call it, travel trailer, tag along. And you can take off and you always got your bike with you. So the next time it comes back from Maryland, it'll have a travel trailer hooked behind it. Okay, <laughs> and that is what we use to get our bike in and out of the truck. So thank you for joining us today. As always, have a great day, and we'll be back soon with more videos. Bye-bye.